going to be painting with Dixie Belle chalk paint today, and I love chalk paint. Chalk paint is water-based, so you don't have to use mineral spirits to clean it up. You can just use soap and water. Chalk paint's amazing if you want to get a rustic or shabby chic or vintage look to your furniture or your home decor, but if you want a more modern look like I do, it's also amazing. So I'm going to be painting with Dixie Belle's Vintage Duck Egg today. I like to mix my chalk paint into a container for sanitation purposes, and it also prolongs the life of your overall container. So we have a couple different synthetic brushes that Dixie Belle makes here today. So this is a two inch flat. This is my favorite for getting full coverage on your piece. And we have already cleaned this piece with Dixie Belle's White Lightning product. I did do a previous video on that, so check out that tutorial. So for little nooks and crannies, which we'll get to later, you can use Dixie Belle's other synthetic brushes that are much smaller and excellent for getting that detail work. Also with chalk paint, remember that water is your friend. It helps you get full coverage on your pieces. So we're gonna get started. So I love this vintage duck egg color because it's kind of like a blue meets green. Oh, look at that, it's just gorgeous. So as you can see, the paint is starting to drag. So what you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna just apply a little bit of water to really get that coverage, this nice mister. Also, these brushes are 100% American made. Oh, that makes such a difference. See how the paint's not dragging? Very nice. So this piece has a factory finish and I only had to sand the top actually. And that's what's great about chalk paint is that with chalk paint, you don't have to use uh, a primer. You don't have to do a pre-sanding unless you need to. You would wanna sand um, if there's a big rut in the wood or an indention. That's probably what you would wanna sand and buff out. And then you could use a product like Dixie Bell's Hemp seed oil to really just highlight your wood. Oh, it's beautiful. Go in the direction that the wood's running. I think I'm gonna switch brushes. This brush is gonna help me get into those nice, oh, that's perfect, very nice. So we're gonna let this dry, and then we're gonna do a second coat. Hey everybody, so we've waited 15 to 20 minutes for our first coat to dry, and just look at the coverage that we've gotten from just one coat of Dixie Belle chalk paint. So we're gonna get started on our second coat of vintage duck egg. 
And Dixie Belle Penny is self-leveling. What that means is that you're not gonna have those awkward patterns and lines that you might have with other chalk paints. It's gonna have that nice, even finish. Also, a lot of people like to wet their paintbrush before they start painting, but you can honestly just jump right in and start painting with a dry brush like I did. And when you do that, you just add a little bit of water with your mister or spray bottle. And it really, you know, depends on what part of the country that you're in, because if you're out there in the desert, you know, you're like a cactus, like, you know, wet that paintbrush, hit that water on there. But we're in Florida, so we're good. So with this second coat, it's really turning into this pretty seafoam green color. I just love it. It's gorgeous. And that's what's cool about the Dixie Belle Color Lab, is that in case this isn't what you were looking for, exactly what you wanted, you can just hop on that Color Lab wheel on the website and create your own custom color. But in this case, I found exactly what I was going for with the vintage duck egg. It's starting to drag, so let's use some water. It's looking so good. Water is your friend with chalk paint. I can't tell people that enough. You know, I was painting, believe it or not, my dining room chairs yesterday. You know, I'm not much of a seamstress. And I always wanted to redo my dining room chairs and fabric. And then I realized that I could use chalk paint to paint the seats. So I did that yesterday. It turned out beautiful. I was very generous with the water, a lot like how I'm doing here. Okay, that looks great. almost done with our second coat. I'm just going to switch to my Dixie Belle mini synthetic brush to get into these grooves that really just make this piece so ornate. And chalk paint can be used on fabric, wood, glass, ceramic. It's so versatile. That's just what one of the many things that I love about chalk paint. We've barely used any paint at all, and we've already done our second coat. So I've just finished painting my second coat on this side, and I'll be back in a jiff because I'm gonna finish painting the rest of this piece. So here we have our finished piece in Vintage Duck Egg. Doesn't it look gorgeous? And this piece is completely done because we use chalk paint. That means that it's ready to go. It doesn't need anything else, and it is completely durable. It cures in 21 to 30 days, doesn't need anything else but in my next video I'm going to show you what Dixie Belle clear coat can do to the look of your piece and we have flat satin and gloss to show you